This is James. James hates when the news lies to him. One day, James was scrolling through the news, looking for something cool to read. I'm looking for something cool to read. Then James saw something that caught his eye. After seeing an article filled with discrepancies and contradictions, James could not believe what he was looking at. I can't believe what I'm looking at. James immediately thought back to the classic quote from the employee union statement of the Washington Post News Guild, saying, We believe it is our responsibility as a news organization to tell the public the whole truth as we know it, about figures and institutions both popular and unpopular, at moments timely and untimely. And oh boy, was this an untimely time in our country. The article James had read was a classic presentation of a fabricated storyline. An infringement upon the journalistic ideals of truth, the story falsely presented a murder with negative connotations to the then presidential candidate Hillary Clinton. Published during the 2016 election cycle, it blatantly attempted to spin a false narrative for political gain. The article was pushed on Facebook, where it was reportedly from the Denver Guardian. The Denver Guardian was not even a real website. This is a big oh-no in the journalism world. Oh, no. Now an enlightened consumer of news, James will be reading each and every article with the eye of a tiger the focus of a sparrow, and the heart of a man who loves truth.